So in this video, I'll be showing how to get parts cleaned up uh, with post-processing after they are printed. So you can see this part just came right off the build plate. If you look closely, you can see it's really rough right here. And that's where the support was. So it printed in this orientation. So this whole face here was supported. And then you also have some supports that are a lot smaller because it's, it's a smaller feature but there's some supports here too. So you can either get those off just with your fingers or you can use a pair of pliers like this. These ones work really well. You can get into really small details really easily. Just like that. The main thing here is that we wanna get this rough surface here cleaned up. So we're gonna start with a sanding board or sanding block like this. And we're gonna start with the coarse sandpaper this is basically just a, a nail, like an emery board. This isn't ever gonna get it perfect, but the goal is just to get it as smooth and flat as we can. Now we can take the fine sandpaper and we can kind of go over this radius and try to get that smoothed out, get it rounded, and then just do a couple more passes just to make that nice and smooth. And then you just wanna feel the part, you know, any, it feels like a burr, but basically it's, it's called elephant's foot. And so you can kind of feel that along the edges that are on that face. So you can feel it here, here, and then in here too. So to clean that up, we can use the deburring tool, the yellow one with the plastic tag. Um, the important thing here is the type of blade that's on there. This one works really well for cutting plastic, but you just want to go really lightly along those edges, just like you were, would if you're deburring apart. It's the minimum material removal is kind of what we're going for. So get the job done, taking off as little material as possible. So we don't wanna do like a really big chamfer on these corners. We just wanna take off that kind of sharp rough edge. Same thing on these. And that one looks pretty good.